Hello, hello everybody. Today is June 23rd, so we're going to check out the new Atomic Shop items for this week. It looks like they brought back the patriotic stuff, so let's just get started. Liberty Prime Power Armor Skin Set. <laughs> Let me tell you, the first time I ever heard one of these things talk while playing in a game, it freaked me out because I was like, the hell kind of new thing to Bethesda put into the game, some kind of new enemy. But it wasn't, it was just Liberty Prime. So here's uh, the armor skin set for it. Whew. You can put it on the Excavator, the Raider, T45, T51, T60, Ultrasight, and X01 Power Armors. Uh, the Power Armor skin will play new fully voiced sound effects while equipped. That's actually a really cool color. Too bad it's not... it doesn't... I don't know if it actually looks like that. I don't think it does because uh, I'm pretty sure they're standing by some kind of a fire or something. Pretty sure it's just this metal. Alright, Stars Ops Under Armor. So you can wear your stars and stripes under your outfits and it won't show. <laughs> so, well I guess you could always wear it with your armor on top of it, but most of your armor ends up covering it. Oh well. Then you got the American Paint uh, Pit Boy skin color. Whew. Hoot Nanny overalls, is that what that said? I actually kind of like the overalls, they're funny looking. And then you got the Stars and Stripes dress. Uh, American flag set. So it looks like, what is that, yellow and bluish colors and then red, white, and blue? Or is that black and white? I don't know. I can't really tell from this distance. Then you got the July 4th backpack mod. American flag wall banner. So I guess if you want to be really patriotic, you can. Freedom Stars Neon Signs. I actually like the stars when they had them out last year. The only thing I don't like is you can't choose each individual star separately. I'm pretty sure you have to put all of them down together. Like in the set of three. Which is a little disappointing because I would have bought it because I would have used the stars individually. Mothman stuff still around so you can get the uh, Traveler bundle if you missed it last week. You can get just the jetpack for your power armor suits. Mothman backpack, plushy backpack, which I did buy, and it is so adorable. He's so cute. <laughs> uh, you can get the icon by itself. I did buy the wallpaper by itself. I haven't used it yet. I'm going to in my next build, so I'm like really excited about that. And then you can get the paratrooper uh, loot bag. So Contemporary Camp Bundle still up. I don't know how many atoms because I already own it. I love this bundle. I've always wanted a nice fancy porch and this bundle gives me that. So you can get the Scabber Bundle for the Raiders. Comes with the uh, T-51 Power Armor model usable for all Power Armor types, a unique outfit, tire backpack, a gold-plated handmade rifle skin, a boy skin, two raiders, standing flags, and a player icon. Alright, and then you can get the Raider Waster Bundle, which comes with a unique T60 Power Armor model, usable for all Power Armor types. Uh, waster 
armor and under armor, tire backpack, a gold plated 50 cal, a pit boy skin, and two raider standing flags and player icon. So you just get a couple of changes from the last bundle, it looks like. Then you can get the vending machine paints. I think this comes with like blue, green, uh, uh, red. Uh, there's the blue, there's the green, red was last. Okay, so two different color blues, sort of. That's, Or maybe that's like a gray. <coughs> then you get the Free States vending machines. Uh, there are vendor signs back again, so if you specialize in a certain kind of item in your vending machines, obviously you can advertise it at your camp to get uh, let players know what you got. The blue door. I actually like this door. Ugh, I was a little disappointed I missed it the last time it was in the camp, but now that I have the double doors with the circus trailer, I actually use that in my house because this sort of has like that double door look. Uh, you can get the mosaic tiles. They're back. Um, a new player icon, have a day. Let's see, so Stars Bundle, ooh, let's check this out, I don't think I've ever actually seen that. The Invasion from the Stars Bundle, <laughs> you're gonna fall, kitten. You get um, Captain Cosmo suit, helmet, and bed, satellite dish, alien plushie, alien blaster, untarnished alien blaster paint, and invader uh, baton. Okay. <laughs> Oh, look at the little plushie. It's so cute. Alright, let's go back. You can get the vault tech bundle. Ooh, the globe is back. So, you get the globe, um, the vault stairs, the vault tech prototype generators, the vault boy 2000 plushie, vault boy 2000 lamp, the vault boy 2000 cardboard cutout, and two um, future tech flags. I'm not a really big fan of the vault boy. He's a little creepy to me, personally. And it's not worth 840 atoms just for me to get my exploding globe back at my camp that I accidentally scrapped. Look at it though, it's so pretty. <gasps> Camouflage bundle for your power armors. So it includes leather metal, leather, metal, and combat armor skins, hunting rifle, and the pump shotgun weapon skins, short and long suits. Ow! Includes the unique wasteland walker paint for each of the T45, T51, T60, and X01 power armors. So you can camouflage yourself. Fancy fancy, go hide in the woods in your camouflage suit. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So, American photo mode frame. I think this is actually free, because I think I got it last year free. Never actually used it. Then you can get the umpire outfit. Uh, the Wiffle Bat skin. Your baseball bat. I actually like that. It's fun. And it makes a sound when you swing it. <laughs> and then you can get the Revolver American Paint set. Uh, let's see. Anything in first? Let's go around. Nope, nothing new. And we've already, sh I've already shown you all the apparel. The new skins, new camp stuff. Um, 
I wish they would bring more hairstyles, honestly, and some more photo mode uh, poses. Because there's, I mean, I know I pretty much have them all, but like one or two. But I want some more that I can use to pose with when I take photos for group events. So yeah, that's everything that's in the Atomic Shop today. Hope you all enjoyed the video and have a great day. Bye!